This is the Sony FX6. Big, big moves here. Hey guys, what's happening? What's going on? Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to another vlog. I'm very excited to bring this video to you guys today. If you've been following along in my journey of camera equipment, of filming, and throughout this YouTube channel, you would have known there's been massive progress since the very first couple of vlogs, even maybe vlogs two or three years ago until what we're creating now. And if you follow me on Instagram and seen some snippets of some of the work I've been doing, things have completely changed. It's actually nuts. Before we get going, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please subscribe down below, leave a comment towards the end, and share this with a friend if you think they'll like this video as well. Back to the video. I have a parcel that has arrived. I have more camera goodies that have arrived, which I actually will leave to another video because there's a lot to unpack here. So let me actually open it up and show you. This is the Sony FX6. Big, big moves here. <laughs> I can't believe I've actually went in the head about an FX6. In the past two years, it's been crazy upgrades. A7R3, A7 III, now I've got an A7R4, and I'm filming on the A7S3. And now I have an FX6, and potentially more things coming on the way. So with COVID, factory fires, and loads of parts missing, this is actually taking a while for it to arrive. I pre-ordered this in July and I was already on a waiting list in July. Some other camera shops are crazy lists, like there are 50 people waiting for this camera. Everywhere is out of stock. However, I've managed to grab one. Before I unbox this and show you what's inside, I'm very excited to bring you on this journey where I show you how I configure this for the stuff I'm filming. And yes, the FX3 and the Sony A7S3, all great cameras all perfect for what I need. And there's some stuff in this camera which just takes it to the next level. So let's open it up and see what's inside. We have power cable, which is kind of standard. What is this here? I literally really haven't watched any videos about people unboxing the FX6, so I'm not 100% sure of what this is. Controller on the side. And then we've got charging cables. Cool shoe and more cables. We have monitor. We have a battery. Guys, this is it. Instruction manual. This is what we're here for. I love a good instruction manual. I mean, I'm joking. Who reads instruction manuals? Charger for battery. Monitor. This has got to be the XLR. Take this out of the box. Okay, so this is the camera. This is the XLR piece, I presume. Okay, this makes more sense when I see this. So you see here, I presume this is the connector that makes all these ports work. The biggest thing that I have is the FX6 doesn't have any 3.5 millimeter audio jacks. There's like nothing on this apart from scratch audio. This connector here, connects here and that provides the audio. I wonder in the future, because I know a lot of people are complaining about it, if Sony will then release something that's slimmer than this, but provides the same thing, like an additional attachment that might just provide one of these or a 3.5 millimeter slot without all the controls. I know a lot of people wanna rock this as small as possible. Um, I mean, it's nice to hold, right? The handle makes it very nice to hold. The only thing, if this was smaller, this would be even more compact. For some of the work I do, I actually don't really need this handle. So I need the ports and that's the biggest thing. But without this attachment, you don't have the ports. Let's just have a look in here. Whoa, it is very close. I'm gonna <laughs> keep that covered. The center is very close to the top. There's not much room there. SDI out, time code in and out, multi remote says what it is, battery slot, CF Express A and SD. I actually think I need to buy a CF Express card, though they are very expensive for what they are. And if I need to buy three or four of them, at least two, that's almost a thousand pounds. 
for two SD cards minus the reader. So plus the reader would be a thousand pounds. And imagine doing a couple of shoots every week and needing to have backups of them. Yo, this is it. FX6, what do you guys think? Okay, that kind of wraps up the video. There is probably a lot more that I wanna say on this camera, but I actually wanna get out and start filming with it and using it a bit more. I am very excited to learn more about how to use the Cinecam. And this is kind of like my step into the Cinecam world. And you never know, this time next year, the year after, we might be rocking red cameras. We might be rocking the FX9. Though, to be honest, I actually think this year, if I can get my hands on another one, have two FX3s, and I'll just use this A7S for vlogging only. I'll be golden and then maybe two cameras for photos, and then I've got everything complete. Okay, I am gonna end this video here, but I wanna leave you with one thought. If you have any questions at all about Sony equipment, what equipment I use, I will do a rundown and a breakthrough of all the equipment that I film on. It will be a bigger video, it might be slightly longer, and I'm gonna do a proper setup so I can show you everything. But if you do have any questions, leave them down below. I've literally had or tried every Sony lens that's out there. And what I mean by that is not the Sony lenses that are bought up by Sigma. I mean literal just Sony branded lenses. Most of the GM lenses, apart from like the super, super, super zoomed in ones, like the 100 to 400 or something, them longer focal ranges, I haven't really tried, but anything shorter, I've tried a majority of them that people might want to buy. So please let me know and I'll see if I can help you. Okay, that's me. I am gonna go and have a play about with my FX6 because I am bloody excited. With all that said, I hope you guys have an awesome day. Again, leave any questions down below. Please, I'd love to answer them for you. And yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one. See you then.